was still a great experience for both teams, though, Joe, and that's it for sport. Thanks very much. Right, thanks for that, Nate. Well, stay with us after the break. Rosanna joins us, and she'll have all the details on the weather for us. Hello, Rosanna Natoli with tonight's weather. It's not looking like the most ideal end to the school holidays as wet weather continues. So maybe consider grabbing gumboots and a raincoat on the back to school shop. Showers will also be ongoing as they make their way in and out over the next seven days. To the rainfall, and Kamala received 63 millimetres, Carmilla 47, 15 in Gargat. Temperatures today across the central coast and highlands, 25 to 32 degrees in Mackay, Bowen a top of 31, 29 on Hamilton Island. To the satellite loop now, and of course the monsoon trough will continue for several days. We can see all of this activity out here. It is currently creating some isolated high rainfalls in Queensland's north tropical coast. Regions around Darwin have received more than 300 millimetres rainfall. On today's chart, evidently that monsoon trough sits north of the nation. You can see it up here, spanning out those clouds. And a ridge of high pressure extends over central and southern Queensland. It is maintained by a high moving east across the Southern Ocean. Now, on tomorrow's chart, that high will have actually reached out into the Tasman Sea by about morning and then continues drifting easterly. A weak tropical low that develops today on the monsoon trough in the Western Coral Sea will also continue moving east. So now to the latest from the Bureau. The boating forecast for Mackay waters, east to southeasterly winds around 15 to 20 knots, turning easterly for Wednesday with seas up to a metre and a half. Tidal variations are on the decrease. Expect a low near 8.30am, a high at 2.30pm. For the central coast and with Sundays, partly cloudy, a high chance of showers most likely in the late morning and afternoon, the chance of a thunderstorm, Mackay's top 31 degrees, Bowen heading for 32, Hamilton Island 30. The central highlands and coalfields partly cloudy with a medium chance of showers and the chance of a thunderstorm, Emerald heading for 35, the same for Claremont, 34 for Morumbah. Looking ahead for Mackay, damp days await us as the showers carry on right up until the weekend and temperatures are staying fairly consistent too as they remain in that low 30s mark. And that is a wrap on Monday night's weather. Now to tonight's sunset all the way from Dead Horse Gap from Paul. Looking pretty special. Thank you for sending that one in. I do love to share them all with you. Now I'll see you again tomorrow night. Bye bye. Lovely. Thanks for that, Rosanna. Well, that's all from us for this Monday. Thanks very much for your company. Just a reminder, you can watch a replay of our news if you missed anything on the 7 Plus app or catch up on our page, 7news.com.au. And from all of us here, enjoy your evening. Good night.